How's it going everyone? Brutal Sam is here and I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak your PS4 version 9.00 without PC. The previous tutorial included PC but this one does not need PC. However, you still need a USB drive and if you don't know how to uh, prepare it, uh, I will be showing you afterwards how you prepare the USB drive to jailbreak your PS4. But there's a few things that I need to tell you that this jailbreak is much, much more stable than 6.72, 7.02 and 7.55. I highly recommend that you update to 9.00, especially if you are on 7.55 or 7.02. Okay, this is really good. I've been testing it all day and the longest it took is three attempts. It always succeeds in the, in the first or the second attempt. The worst that happened was the third attempt. So I highly recommend that you update to 9.00. So let's get into this. Uh, the first host that we'll be using is from Nasky. This host is ps4exploit.zd.lu. Okay. Now, when this website loads, don't click on the uh, jailbreak button here. Don't click on it yet. Just let the website uh, cache itself. As you can see here at the top left corner, it's caching. So before we do anything, we'll let it cache so we can access it offline later. And we don't need, uh, we will not need the internet to access this website again. So let it cache and then we will proceed with jailbreaking okay almost there all right it's done caching you can just go and turn off the internet come back here and click on the jailbreak button all right this is the first attempt okay this means jailbreak wasn't successful this is the first attempt we click OK and now the second attempt all right wasn't successful either this is the third attempt all right there you have it we have a jailbreak now all we have to do is plug in the usb drive so i'm gonna plug it in all right we got a notification so let's wait for gold hand to load all right, there you have it. Gold Hand version 2.0b has been loaded without PC. So this is uh, much better than the PC method. And as you can see, the debug settings is here. The Gold Hand uh, menu is here. We can even test the FTP server. It's working perfectly, as you can see. No problems, uh, no nothing. So yeah, pretty pretty much easier than the previous PC method. All right, we're done with first host, so let's move on to the second host, which is K row 218.ir. Okay, when the website loads, we're gonna click on the 9.00 gold, which is gold hand version 2.0 so click on 9.00 gold okay now the website will start caching so as you can see here on the top it's caching so again we will not touch anything uh, until the website has finished caching all right it's done caching so uh, I'm gonna close the web browser then open it all right Okay, now we can just start jailbreaking by clicking on the gold hand V2 button here. This is the uh, first attempt. We're waiting for that notification to appear. So uh, that wasn't successful. So first attempt isn't successful. This is the second. We're waiting for that notification to appear so we can plug in the USB drive. And there you have it. Now we can plug in the USB drive. So allow me to plug it in. Give it a second and a notification should pop up. As you can see, it's done. Gold hand has been loaded and now the 9.00 PS4 is jailbroken and you can play whatever you want. So the debug settings are here. The gold hand menu 
is here. So uh, yeah, those are the only two hosts that I tested today and they seem to work perfectly. And now I'm going to show you how to uh, prepare the USB drive for jailbreaking. So the first thing is we need to go and download this Win32 disk imager. So download this uh, software. Okay. All right, just go ahead and open it. Click on accept and we basically install it just like we install any software. All right, uncheck, uncheck and finish. Next, we need to download the jailbreak file from here, which is the uh, xfathacks.image. So we need to download this one. This is the jailbreak. Okay. All right, now we have it. It's done. Now go ahead and double click on the software that you just installed. Make sure that this is the, uh, the USB drive letter. Make sure this is your USB drive, okay? Click here and select XFAT Hacks. Click on Open. And now we will simply click on Write, okay? All right. Everything in the USB drive will be deleted, so make sure you don't have any important data stored in that USB drive. Just back it up somewhere else, okay? Hit yes, and there you have it, we're done. This is the USB drive that you will need to jailbreak your PS4 every time. So keep it in a safe place. There's still no way to jailbreak 9.00 without a USB drive just yet. And uh, by the way, I should mention that this process, uh, this USB making is a one-time thing. Uh, you're not gonna need PC again after this. You just need to make this USB and then you're done with PC. You can just use the USB drive uh, every time you want to jailbreak your PS4. So yeah, this is pretty much everything. This is it. And uh, I will see you in future tutorials and I hope this was helpful to you. Take care. See you soon.